how explain to us the uh, process that okay. they would pick up? Um, when people come in, we always like to know first off when's a prom, what are the color of the dresses, what are the guys' taxes looking like. And then they can either look through the book, this has several different styles, and they're all kind of color coordinated, everything from hair pieces to wristlets to rings, everything for your shoes, everything. And then they come over here and we start off with, uh, of course with the girls, most of them want a wristlet. So we start off with wristlets right here and they can take their pick of whichever ones they want. And then we let them try them on, make sure they're not too big or too little. Apologize, we've sold several, so <laughs> this is the last weekend. Um, and then they can try them on. These are the rings, which are fun. And then you could do flowers on those. Do um, even the necklaces if you wanted to do that. Mm -hmm. But once they pick out their wristlet, then we go over to pick out flowers as to what color flowers they want. That'll accent their dress. We do like them to bring in the dress if they can, especially if it's not just black and white, but something a little more difficult to match. Then um, they can take their pick of the flowers. Of course, colors we can always change. Then we add accents, whether it's rhinestones or pearls or any kind of wired uh, leaves, laser leaves, and then we just add to it. We also have um, quite a few just natural stones that are here. Um, a lot of the people really like those, whether it's the tiger eye, turquoise, amethyst, carnelian, black onyx, quartz, pink quartz, rose quartz. So anyway, and then we um, use those a lot in corsages too, just depending on what's it, what their dress looks like. Interesting. Yeah. So, so has have is this the way that you've always done your prom corsages, or is this a new? The first year that we were here, we we've, we've been here three and a half years. Um, we did it mostly out of a book, and it was very difficult because the kids really didn't know what they wanted. So we would have to get a lot of fresh flowers and try to explain it to them. After that, it was just too much. So that's where the board came in, mm -hmm. and. Um, a great idea. Yeah, it really is. And then that way you can really see almost identically to what it's going to look like. Granted, the silks are usually a little bit bigger, of course, more perfect. But you know, you explain to them, you know, it's not going to be that big or it's not going to be right, you know. Um, but then that way the kids really like it. And of course, then you can take off, you know, hey, I want this. And then, you know, okay, you want this. Now, what kind of flowers do you want with it? Well, I don't know what I want. Well, okay, you know, you can take this and go, well, we could do something like this. It'll look similar to this. This color ribbon, this color flowers, this color stones. And then that way they have a better idea of what they're yeah. getting. And then they're not surprised when they get it. Of, I didn't think that's what that was going to look like. Well, I don't know how because we have it in front of you. And uh, so, you know, the good thing is you've got your traditional girls and guys and you have your very contemporary girls mm -hmm. and guys. And so that way we can actually help with each. And then we've even done straight out with just... Curly Willow, where we've used um, the Hypericum or just the um, snake grass, and mm -hmm. we've done different fun stuff like that. Have um, you seen any new trends um, that have really been popular this year, or that you wouldn't have thought of before? Not this year. Last year, the fiber optic lights were big, and I hated them because <laughs> they were very hard, very bulky to build into a corsage when they mm -hmm. wanted small. But really, for this year, not really. Um, I'm seeing this year not quite as much money invested in the wristlets. They're they were happier with the plain wristlet for two or three dollars instead of a twenty dollar really nice piece of jewelry. I'd say a few more went for the regular wristlets than they did for these. Have you seen an increase in say flowers to wear or flowers for the hair? Uh, I've seen more on the arm pieces and more hair pieces this year and rings rings have been very popular which are fun because and we can do those out of the, the actual wire pieces I think you've been to Adams mm -hmm. um, and they showed me how to do the rings so we do a lot of those and then also the rhinestone mm -hmm. yeah and they're fun it's fun stuff and do you think this has increased your sales big time big time yeah because I can people see it and they go oh well I want that too or well I like that too or well you know or, the, you know, they'll come in and they'll go, well, I like this, but I don't like those colors. Not a problem. What color do you want? Well, you know, instead of these hematite beads, can I have the red coral? Well, yeah, that's fine. Or they'll go, well, you know, I like this, but I want rhinestones to go with it. Not a problem. You know, they're $2 more a piece. How many do you want? <laughs> what color do you want? Yeah. And then that's where you take your thing and go, well, my dress is blue. Oh, okay. Well, cool. Then what we can do is we can actually take this. Just again, why everything's easy to come on and off. Mm -hmm. And just go, well, you know, we could do that and build these in like that. And then, you know, it'll look like that. We can add the ribbon. 
you know, so right. that way you can really piece it and, and show it to them in their mind what it's going to look like. And it's a one of a kind, everything just for them. Yeah. yeah, yeah, and it's everything wonderful. matches. And um, you know, and it's funny. Several of the moms I get so tickled at, I go, "Gosh, it's a lot different than it used to be." I'm like, "Oh yeah, you know, used to we would go and it would be carnations or roses." That was our choices. Yeah. You know, and now they go, well, I just need to order a corsage. How much is it? Well, you know, what do you want? And then when you start telling them what all is available, then they're like, oh, well, I think I'm going to come in. And that's what we say. We say, you know, it would be easy if you can come in, bring the dress. Yeah. Um, especially on the colors that are hard to match. Um, we had a mom come in. Well, it's a champagne pink. Okay, well, <laughs> what exactly color is that? And so once they brought the dress in, it was really more on the cream side. Yeah. Than the pink side, and so that way it can match. Yeah, it's definitely a more creative process, yes. a, a much more custom. Right, it is custom, and it's fun. And it's fun, exactly. You know, the, the I think the hardest part is getting the girls in that really don't know what they want. And once you get their dresses together, you can see in their face when they like something. Yeah, because you go, they'll go, oh yeah, I like that. <laughs> but then you have those who don't. You know, we have um, these have been. Not as popular as I would like, but I think they're pretty cool. Those are beautiful. And then once you know you're done with the corsage, hello. hello. Then this part actually comes off, and then you actually have a, a actual bracelet. Yeah, no, we just want to look at the yeah, it's pretty. And I